Hello everyone, today I got a hobby box of 22-23 Upper Deck Series 2. Hoping for some big cards in here, exclusive high gloss, any hobby exclusive stuff would be nice. And yeah, let's get right into it and hope to get a big pull. Alright, so let's get into the first pack here, Series 2. Not sure if I've opened any of this hobby on the channel before. I'm not sure what that is. We do have a clear cut to start off. Okay, hopefully it's a young gun. Clear cut is nice. So Corey Perry, Ricard Raquel, and it, it's a young guns. No, it's not a young guns clear cut. Let's see. It's going to be, I thought it was a young guns clear cut for a second. Thomas Shabbat clear cut. So that's nice. Second pack here. Pretty good start with that clear cut. All right, so let's get into it. We does look like we have a young gun here. So first young gun, get it into focus. And sorry for my chair, it's being so loud. The first young in here is going to be of Nick Perbix. So that is the first one there on the lightning. Bit of damage there on the bottom left corner, sadly. Just a regular young gun there. Not a jersey. You can pull jerseys in here, so that would be nice. We do have our second young gun right away. It's going to be a Ben Jones on the Golden Knights. So there is Jones. Not sure who goes with who if there is any pattern to the young guns so don't know who to expect anyways we're gonna have a welcome to detroit so that you usually get two of those per box that would be a cool set to put together of all the teams that would be a, a pretty nice all right let's, let's keep going here and we're gonna have a thomas bordelow for calder didn't win the Calder, but it's a uh, cool insert there. I believe Matty Beniers won it this year. Or this was last year now. All right, next pack. We do have another young gun here. Come on, give me someone good. It's going to be... It's not a young gun. <laughs> Barabanov base card. Mark Kastelik, rookie portrait. All the portraits are rookies in Series 2. Okay. I think too big yet, but you never know with hobby. You can get some some rare hits, some Easter egg cards. So never know what to expect. We have an instant impressions here of Ryan O'Reilly. Still on St. Louis there as the captain. He went to Toronto and now he's playing on Nashville. Come on. We do have our blue dazzler here. It's going to be a Philip Ross on the Blackhawks. So you do get one of those per box, and then you have a chance of pulling the pink Dazzlers. Those are a bit more rare. And then there's like Program of Excellence cards and all those different things because it is Series 2. We do have a shiny Honor Roll. So this is going to be numbered at a 25, if I'm not mistaken. So it is Honor Roll. It's going to be numbered, should be. It's going to be of Noah Cates, not at a 25, it's at a 250. But there's Noah Cates uh, Honor Roll, numbered 220 out of 250. So nice to hit a numbered card there. Okay, almost halfway through the box. No canvas cards yet. Um, again, 50% shot at a young gun canvas. So it would be nice to get one of those. Um, not sure what we have here. It's going to be our French variant of Marcus Foligno. You seem to get one of these per box. And it's just a base. So that's too bad. Yeah, I believe we're exactly halfway through now. Still looking for four more young guns. So our next one's going to be here. It's going to be an Ethan Prow young gun on the Sabres. So that's going to be our third hit of the break. All right, still three young guns left. And looking for those canvas cards. Hopefully we hit a young gun canvas. We're going to have a World Junior Grads of Jordan Cairo on the Blues. Okay, what do we got here? First canvas card, maybe? We have another portrait. It's going to be of Jacob Moverari in the rookie portraits. And more base. Base stack's getting a bit high now. Can't see the background. All right. Do have another young gun here. Come on. Give me someone good. Let's see. The next young gun will go from here. It's going to be of Ottawa Senators, Cole Reinhardt. I was hoping it would be Jake Sanderson, but we get Reinhardt instead on our fourth young gun pull. Still two left. There's still a chance at hitting 
one of the bigger names, but nothing too big yet. We're just going to have an honor roll here of Samuel Fagamo. Checklist there of Dreisaitl and McKinnon. Next pack. Jersey cards would be cool to hit, but it doesn't look like we're going to pull one. I have hit one before from this product. We're going to have everyone's favorite insert, Lunchbox Legends of Jack Hughes. I've been trying to pull his young gun recently with a couple, some hobby packs of 1920, tin, some other stuff you'll see on the channel, but as of now, no Hughes as of yet. We're going to have our fifth young gun, I want to say. It's going to be of Shane Wright there on the Seattle Kraken. So that's one of the better ones you can get. Shane Wright seemed to pull him a lot. <laughs> so hopefully he uh, he can develop into a really good player. Again, he was supposed to go first overall. He ended up going fourth, but I still don't think he's going to be pretty good. No canvases? Our last young gun here. Come on, give me an exclusive young gun. We're going to have Dennis Chisholm on the Jets. Don't have him yet, so that's good. But that is going to be our sixth young gun, unless we hit some type of variation. Okay, we have six packs left and looking for four canvas cards. So definitely hoping for that canvas young gun. This is just going to be a base canvas, sadly. Wow, this really does not want to focus today. We First one's going to be Jaden Schwartz on the Kraken. It's going to be our first canvas card, saving them all to the end. All right. Next pack here. We're going to have another welcome to. This one's going to be New York. That's a cool one. The Rangers. So we got Rangers and Detroit in this box. Four packs left. Come on. We have another canvas here. It's just going to be a regular canvas of Alexi Lafreniere signing a jersey. So it's always nice pictures on the canvas. Three packs left. What will we get? It's going to be an honor roll, sadly. Just Trey Fix Walensky on the honor roll. So no jersey card. Just two packs left and two canvases left. So still hoping for a young gun canvas. This is going to be a young gun canvas. No, it's going to be a retired canvas of Tony Esposito there. So I'd rather have young gun canvas, but still not bad to get a retired canvas. Those are one in 192 packs. So it's a rare card to get. So there's Esposito. So cool card in the last pack. Guessing it's going to be a base canvas, but you never know. And look, I'm right. It's going to be Leon Dreisaitl. So good player to get. So there is Dreisaitl to end off the break. So overall, not a bad box. Um, the young guns weren't great, but we did hit some cool inserts. Again, I'll show you a quick recap. Shane Wright was probably the best card there, so it's still not bad. Some more young guns I could put towards my set. The Noah Kate set of 250 was cool, and I believe we did hit something in the beginning. Yes, the clear cut of Shabbat in the first pack. So yeah, that's it. If you did enjoy the video, leave a like, subscribe for more. I'll try to get some other hobby boxes on the channel, something cool soon. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one.